Simone Biles' biological mother, Shannon, lives in, in Ohio and in a drug-infested neighborhood. Simone Biles' biological mother, Shannon, lives in Ohio in a drug-infested neighborhood. She has been living in the same rundown row house for years. Her millionaire daughter, Simone Biles, the Olympic gold medal winner, does not talk to her. Shannon abandoned her kids when she was on drugs. Her father stepped in and raised Simone and her younger sister. Shannon said she watched her daughter winning at the Olympics. She says she wished she had been invited to her daughter's wedding. Simone Biles' mother says she worked at a grocery store as a cashier. Hopefully, Simone can find it in her heart to forgive her mother. But listen, that's not for you. That woman didn't feed her kids, man. Her, Simone was very um, malnutritioned as a kid, and I think that's why she's so small. Um, I think that's one of the reasons she's so small, because she was so malnutritioned as a kid. Um, so yeah, I, I don't know if you can tell somebody to forgive their mother for being on drugs and not feeding them when they were a kid. That's not my business to tell her to forgive her mom for that, man. That's nobody's business to tell. That's nobody's business to tell that girl that she got to forgive her mom for not feeding her and, you know, keeping her in deplorable conditions as a kid. That's that's actually that's out, you're out of line for saying that that she need to go forgive that woman. That's out of line. That's this ain't like a Kobe situation. With Kobe, it's a little different. Kobe grew up in luxury. His father was an NBA player and played in Europe. Kobe traveled the world, trips, basketball camps, safe environments, and upper class neighborhoods in Italy where he grew up learned several languages so Kobe's beef with his parents is a little bit different and even that one it's not for me to say you know uh he should have treated his parents better because especially over a girl over his wife they didn't like his wife his wife kind of finessed him, you know. He met a he met a video chick like a month into his NBA career and wanted to marry her. And they were like, "Damn, bro, you just got to the NBA five minutes ago, and now you already want to get married to a video hoe." So that kind of caused beef with the parents. But this one right here is different. With Kobe, you can say, "Okay, well, your parents raised you in luxury, and they did everything for you, and you." never missed a meal you never went without yet you everything you wanted great family great huxtable like upbringing this girl right here you kind of out of line for telling her she need to apologize she need to um forgive her mom maybe maybe her mom is a, a maybe her mom is maybe getting away from her mom has been such a blessing that she feels like if she goes back she's gonna um ruin her blessing Sometimes you never go back. Sometimes you don't go back. So, yeah, man, um, telling this girl she need to, I, I think that's out, totally out of line, man. Um, you say her mom actually helped her. Well, the dad, her, the mom's dad actually raised, the, the grandparents raised her. So, yes, yeah, so, like, um, her dad raised her. Yeah, the mom's dad raised her. Um. And listen, people think that just because you work at a at a grocery store that, and live in a row house that your life is miserable. And I get like given, say Simone gives this woman a bunch of money. Say that Simone gives gives her mom an allowance. Let's just say she gives her mom, you know, five thousand dollars a month allowance. Who's to say that her mom isn't going to start using drugs again? Because money exposes your character what do they say how's the saying go money doesn't um make your character it it accentuates it <laughs> you know what i'm saying it, it, 
maybe the worst thing in the world for Simone to do is to give this ex-drug addict a bunch of money. And why does everybody have to be rich? Why does everybody have to live in luxury that's associated or related to somebody who's wealthy? 